the knowledge, ability, willingness, and capabilities that these young people do have. And it's all based on providing them the right leadership, guidance, and direction. Finished my 10th year at a private school coaching the seventh and eighth grade boys basketball team. And this young, this team that I had this year was probably, in all of my years coaching, one of the top two teams I've ever coached. And it had absolutely nothing to do with the game of basketball. It had to do with this team's accountability and their responsibility and their understanding of the common goal. And that goal was our team motto, which is team before self. And I'm gonna give you an example of what I'm talking about. We had a young man on the team that uh, broke a team rule. The, a couple of days later, a couple of kids came to me and they said, coach, uh, so-and-so broke the rule or he did what we asked him not to do. And my immediate response to them was, uh, what do you uh, propose to, we do about it? And without hesitation, uh, these two young men said, make him sit in the bleachers and watch us run. I said, what? They wanted him to sit in the bleachers and watch them run. And he's the one that broke the rule. So it took me a second. I'm like, I love that. I said, I love it so much. I'm going to use that as my punishment for the team and for him. And so I said, but of course, if you guys want to impose any more uh, disciplinary actions against him, that's going to be a team decision. Made the young man uh, sit in the bleachers and he watched the guys run. And afterwards, the team went in the locker room and they were in there for about uh, four or five minutes. So one of the guys spoke up and said, coach, we've all discussed it, voted on it, and it was unanimous. And they said, for the next game, this young man will not dress, nor will he play. And I didn't hesitate. I said, hey, team decision, I support it. And of course, my, my next action was to turn this young man and, and make sure he understood what was happening at this moment. And he said, absolutely. And I said, now, you know, you're going to have to go home and explain to your parents why you will not be dressing or playing in the next game. He goes, yes, sir. It's what's so great about these young people. They have the ability, they have the willingness, and they're capable of taking leadership and making the right decisions, not just for themselves, but for those around them. And they can influence those to also make the right uh, decisions.